Last minute preparations underway for the 74th annual Iroquois steeplechase, the running of the horses. Our Cuthbert Langley is live at Percy Warner Park this morning with a preview. Good morning. It looks like you got the bow tie, you got the seersucker jacket. Man, you are all you need is a big hat now and you're set. I know, right? I hope Amy has a big hat I can borrow. Maybe she can uh, <laughs> send one down for us here. But yeah, it's steeplechase. You got to dress the part. I actually had this in my closet believe it or not, having grown up in uh, Charleston, South Carolina. But uh, it's going to be a fun weekend out here. Preparations are underway. A lot of the tents are up. I've never seen so many porter potties in my life, too. I can tell you guys that they are prepared. This is look from last year's Seaple Chase. These big hats equal big, big bucks for businesses as well. Stores like Gus Mayer and Green Hills have been busy with race fans picking out that right hat or dress. Christine A. Moore, we talked to her yesterday. She brought in a special shipment of hats all the way up from New York City. Vineyard Vines have steeplechase wear for the guys. Plenty of bow ties and seersucker for the big race. Steeplechase is a day to be to be see to see, excuse me, and to be seen as well. So we are expecting big crowds coming out here. The first race is around 1:15 tomorrow. They've got races all over the place, and the fashion is going to be one of the biggest things here this weekend. Take a listen. Southern ladies love hats. They just love to dress. They love color. They love to outdo each other, which is so fun. You know, it's like, you know, just it's wondering what your friends are going to wear. And I can tell you, I'm coming out here tomorrow, and I can tell you the, the whole discussion all week has been about what is everybody going to wear? How big are the hats going to get on the girls? What kind of bow ties are the guys going to wear? So it's going to be a lot of fun. And if you want to shop out here while the races are going on, you can. Vineyard Vines will be out here selling stuff. And if you do want to go, you can always get general admission tickets the day of. And for 100 bucks, you can buy tailgating singles when you get out here. It's also the first time that they're going to have live music on the stage and the infield as well. So no doubt all the way around is going to be a party out here. So get your mint juleps ready to go because it's going to be a hot weekend, but a fun weekend out here. We're live at Percy Warner. I'm Cuthbert Langley, News Channel 5 HD. All right, Cuthbert, sounds good. Thanks a lot.